Heart sounds and charting. Using the diaphragm, we're auscultating the heart for high pitch sounds. We then repeat the same areas with the bell to detect low pitch sounds. Reference my heart sound video to learn more on this. We have five landmarks here. Remember the mnemonic, all physicians enjoy taking money. In all of these landmarks, we should hear the classic lub dub, which corresponds to the closure of the semilunar and AV valves. We will hear the S2 or dub sound louder at the base and S1 or lub sound louder at the apex. Now, the first two sounds are heard at the second intercostal space. Easiest way to find this is to locate the sternal notch Walk your fingers down until you find a distinct bony ridge and then go to either side of that. Herb's point is at the halfway point between the base and the apex of the heart. This is at the third intercostal space, so put your fingers in a peace sign at the second rib and you'll be able to hit this. We're going to do this again for the fourth landmark. Fifth landmark, draw an imaginary line from the clavicle to right under the nipple and you should be in the general area. We're also using auscultation to assess rate and rhythm. These are your normals and to chart all of this, we'd say normal rate and rhythm, no murmurs, rubs, or gallops noted on exam.